Hive Mind Network Online, Channel 0093. Secure uplink initiated. Stinger OS now active. Welcome, Agent. Hello, Droby here. I'm here to show you around the Alpha 0.2 of the Stinger OS for 19.4. This is the fourth uh, tutorial video and the last one in this series going over the aspects of the Alpha 0.2 and the modules we have in place right now. Uh, if you're just joining us, welcome, and I invite you to check out the introduction video to this series, which you can find in the description below or at the end of this video. What we're going to be doing specifically here is we're going to be looking into uh, the host fingerprinting and then the Fox Acid server malware injection tools to complete uh, the objective of our mission. Uh, we're using what we already have, uh, which we gathered in the last couple of videos about blackwatchman.com. Of course, this isn't the actual target for the mission of this alpha, just using it as an example. And we're gonna see about finding out the technology behind the open ports we've found for the subdomains. Now the reason that we're doing this is because the Fox Acid server injects very specific kinds of malware it knows work well against very specific technologies. So in order to know what those technologies are, we have to do a host fingerprint. So how we're gonna do that is we're gonna open up a tool here. Information gathering module initiated. So we're gonna open up host fingerprint and what we're gonna do is we're gonna fingerprint blackwatching.com and we're gonna fingerprint the port 80 which is the one that we've found to be open on this subdomain. So now while that's running, uh, I can just explain to you a little bit about how this works. So basically what this is doing is it's trying to figure out which specific technology is running off of that port. So it sends signals out on that port. And then when it gets those signals back, it's able to tell us which uh, server or technology is being run off that port. So in this case, we got back the Apache server, which is not, uh, not that surprising considering that Apache is the most common web server used uh, for uh, the World Wide Web. And so, but now this means that we know the technology so we can take the next step. So the technology used on www.blackwatchman.com is Apache. Now with this information, let's go in and check out the Fox Acid server. So I'm gonna open another workspace here. Fox Acid server connection initiated. So this Fox Acid server is very exciting stuff. It's based on real NSA, a real NSA system, and it's a set of servers that is used to inject specific kinds of malware. Now it works with tools like Second Date, various quantum attacks, and Validator. You can find more information about all of these real NSA tools in the description of this video. Uh, but I can quickly tell you that it it does all sorts of fun stuff, like install backdoors for a C2 registry, can access nearly any files on a system, and it can gain very detailed information about the target's network. Now, let's try and implant some malware into uh, blackwatchman.com. And if you look, this is actually the example that we have up here right now. So we'll just follow this example, and we'll see what we get. And I'll explain to you a little bit more about what's going on as we let it run. So we're going to do this against the subdomain Black Watchman or Black Watchman's website www.blackwatchman.com and we're doing that against the open port 80 that we found with the technology we know is behind that port which is Apache so now it is going to attempt to inject the malware now at this stage uh, the way that we set up this uh, module is that it selects which tools it which malware tools it knows to be effective against an apache server and will send it along that port to that subdomain we might want to change this because we might want to make it more uh customizable for you because at, at certain stages you might find a target that is more vulnerable and will be vulnerable to various different kinds of attacks so you know learning about which attacks and what those do would be very interesting 
to uh, to decide based on your mission parameters what's going to be most effective. Now, in this case, uh, the attack failed because the uh, this uh, port and the technology behind it is not vulnerable to this kind of attack. That's fine. This is simply a demonstration. Uh, what you have to do in this alpha is go in, based on the mission, is to go in and find stuff within the Roper group. So the thing to do there is going to be go to go into your mission center, look at that recon map that was created by uh, Maltigo CE, and figure out based on what you now know you need for the Fox Acid server, which is once again, you need a subdomain, you need an open port, and you need the technology behind that port. And you can run multiple uh, recon scans of the various entities connected to Roper Group, you know, um, Morpho Medical, uh, the Rosenberg Clinic, and see what you can find, what are available open ports, and what are the technologies behind those ports. And then when you have that information, bring it to the Fox Acid server, see which of those is vulnerable. That will help you complete your mission. That's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. I'll be back to explain more modules when we release Alpha 0 0.3. Uh, but for now, that's it for the tutorial. So thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Closing route access. Goodbye. You can find more 19.4 tutorials here, like an intro to the Stinger OS, a look into mission structure in the Maltigo CE recon graphs, DNS and port scanning attacks, plus fingerprinting and the Fox Asset server. You can also pre-order the game by clicking on the bottom right hand of the screen.